lot going on here, people. We're trying to determine symmetry algebraically. Let's look at this. To determine x-axis symmetry, you let I think the pink marker's a bust. We let the opposite of y, and then we try to find whether or not that guy is the same function. So that's 2 times minus y to the third, not gonna be 5, I didn't do anything to x, to the third plus 6, whoa, whoa there, that's an odd power, so that's minus 2 y to the third is 5x to the third plus 6. Now we check, is this the same? Oh, you are not the same. So it is not x-axis symmetry. Then we go and we check to see if y. For y-axis symmetry, we let uh, minus x, and we put it in there. That's 2y to the third. That's 5 times a minus x to the third plus 6. That's 2y to the third. That's going to be, it's an odd power. So that's minus 5x to the third plus 6. Are these the same? No, that's not equal. Now, one more time. Let's check for origin. Let's check for origin. So it was not y. So for origin, for origin, all right, we're going to let minus x and minus y. So we're checking that guy. All right. So then that's 2 times uh, minus y to the third, that's 5 times a minus x to the third plus 6. So what? That's a minus 2y to the third. Can you? Yeah, we're good. And a minus 5x to the third plus 6. Are these the same? No. They're not the same. Because of that plus 6, we can't get rid of that minus sign now. Let's go and look at this. Let's let a minus x happen. So I put a minus x squared plus a y squared. That's 6. Okay. That's an even power. So it's minus x times minus x, which is x squared plus y squared. That's 6. Are these the same? Yeah, so this is y symmetric. All right, let's check x. Check x symmetry. So we let a minus y happen. So I put a minus y up in there. So that's x squared plus a minus y squared is 6. Again, we get our original function. So this is x-symmetric. To check origin symmetry, we let, we let, we let a minus x and a minus y. So a minus x and a minus y. When we let a minus x and a minus y up in there, we have a minus x squared plus a minus y squared. That's still equal to 6. Well, that's x squared plus y squared is 6. So this has all three types. Great. What's next? This guy. Oh. Fancy notation. What? What is that? That's the function y is equal to a minus 3. What does that look like graphically? That's this one. Da 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 Does it have x-axis symmetry? If I fold it, is it a pit? No, it's not x. What about y? What about y? If I fold it across y, is it the same on the left as it is the right? Yes! So it's y symmetric. Now what? Origin. If I fold it on the y and then fold it on the x, so I fold it on y, bam, da 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 da, it's on itself. And then I fold, oh no, 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 no. Not origin.
Yeah. That's pretty much all we got to say about symmetry. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. <laughs>